Thanks so much, Kristen. On to news happening today. Officials are looking to make the streets safer by approving a plan they say will help inmates after they're released from jail. News 13's Sarah Yingling joins us live from downtown where the Reentry Resource Center will be approved. Good morning, Sarah. Good morning, Crystal. Yeah, like you said, if approved, the Reentry Resource Center will be here at the Public Safety Center on Roma. It's designed to be a stepping stone between their last day in jail and their first day of life on the outside. Every day, dozens of inmates are released from MDC. Many will then face homelessness, addiction, or untreated mental illness. And nearly every day, we hear from police about how those with substance abuse problems will do anything to feed their habits. Officials say the continuity of care provided to these individuals is fragmented, which can lead to them ending up back behind bars. That's where the Reentry Resource Center comes in with two primary components. First, to provide care while in MDC by identifying those at a high risk for reoffending, creating a transition plan, and then coordinating with case managers at RRC. Those inmates will then be taken into the RRC and be given the opportunity for temporary shelter, brief interventions, and connecting them with family or community providers and access to service information. The cost of this program will be a little more than $1 million a year to run, but officials say with improved health outcomes, less reliance on emergency rooms like ERs and first responders, and a lower weight of reoffending, that this program will end up paying for itself. Back to you. All right, thanks so much, Sarah. And officials say they won't be able to reach every single inmate returning to the community, but their goal is to reach a maximum number of individuals with the highest need. The meeting scheduled for 5 o'clock tonight.